And now Rutschman will bat. He was also 0 for 2 in the game on Tuesday here. Drives that one well. Out to right field, and what a start to the back half of the campaign for Adley Rutschman. Sizzles into the front row, and the Birds have a 2-0 lead. A low-line missile. Garcia barely moved, but it was a wall scraper. Good for Adley. Hadn't had an extra base hit in his last seven games. Colton Kowser, who really had the tail of two halves in the first half. That sizzling April and that rough May through middle July. And he hits one in the air to right and deep. Garcia is back. He's turning around, and that baby's gone. Colton Kowser hits a two-run homer, and it's 4 to nothing, Baltimore. The Orioles' second two-run homer of the inning. They have jumped all over Nathan Uvalde. Some 420 feet late. Low, low 262 average. That's in the air center field. And that takes Mullins back to the wall. It is gone! Seventh of the year for Nathaniel Lowe, and he has the Rangers on the board. That one was crushed to dead center field, 434 feet. It's home run derby gone. In the third, so he's one for two. Anthony smokes one to deep right field. That baby is long gone. Way out. Number 25 into the lap of a bird fan. Another two-run homer for the Orioles. And they lead this game 6-1. to one. A bomb to right field for Santander. Well, if Lowe can get a hit, maybe an extra base hit, and cut into this deficit, Rangers right back in it. Right side, Mateo dives up with it, throws the first, he got him. Jorge Mateo with a dive comes up throwing and gets Nathan Lowe to end the... Anthony Santander jolted a two-run shot back in the fifth inning. <laughs> and that's rocketed down the line. Will it stay fair? It sure will. It's a two-homer night for Anthony Santander. And he's blown this game open with a three-run homer. The Orioles' fourth homer of the game. The only question on that one was, would it stay fair? Out here in this ninth, Jonah Heim the batter. Heim backs up Mountcastle, handles it first. Birch to the bag to finish the ball game. Corbin Burns was outstanding on the hill. And the O's go into the home stretch, posting a convincing 9-1 win and take the series opener over the Texas Rangers. They have now won four of five against Texas head-to-head -head here this season. He's up Cedric Mullins. Corners were creeping in, anticipating Mullins with the butt. Scherzer will handle it and throw it up the right field line. They get Baltimore on the board. Kowser goes to third, and Mullins slides into second. He not only got him over, he got him in. Well, this is a great butt from Cedric Mullins. Tough play for Scherzer. Urias now the batter. Line drive into center field. That's a base hit. And this will play two. The throw comes into center field. And Mullins will score standing. And Urias will make it to second on the throw. It's 3 nothing ball. This inning. Chance to get out of the inning now. Into right field for a base hit. Urias will trot in. Another RBI for Santander. As he drives in his sixth of the series. He makes it 4 nothing. 2-2. Two -two. Swinging that one is punched through the right side. A base hit down the line. One run scores. Foskey rounds third. He comes home and scores. Andrew Kisner with a two run, two out, two strike single. And the Rangers are on the board here in the bottom of the second. They cut the Devers. Answered with two in the bottom half of the inning. Arania throws it. Hit well. Deep right field. Looking up is Garcia. And it's gone. Cedric Mullins with the shot into the seats and right. Poor kid looked like he was had mixed emotions about that. Kind of home run ball, but it's the wrong team. The Orioles lead it. Back to their bullpen here in the sixth. Two outs here. And the runner on, and Jordan Westberg's the best. Westy drives it in the air. Straight away center field. Tavares at the wall. Can't get to it. It is gone. Two-run home run for Jordan Westberg. His 16th of the season. Birds have built a 7-2 lead. That's the third ball he's hit hard tonight. And on the corners. And that ball is laced out to left field. That gets down base hit. One run is in. Seeger heading to third. Heading to second base with an RBI double. Is Wild Langford. Five times tonight. O'Hearn slashes this to the gap in left center field. Langford on the run. Turning around. And that baby's gone. A solo shot for Ryan O'Hearn. And after being hit by a pitch twice tonight, some payback in the ninth. Now that 
Heston Thurman, two outs, and the tie run is in the on-deck circle. The very dangerous Corey Seager will bat. And he got him. Down on strikes. Kimbrell slams the door to finish the ball game. The Orioles have their 60th win of the season. They're the first team in the American League to get to 60 wins. Second base. They'll bring up Jonah Heim. It'd be great to get a big two-out hit here. Well, he could use it, too, and he smokes that ball. High in the air, deep out to right center. It is gone! Well, there's that big hit. Jonah Heim's ninth home run of the year. And the Rangers draw first blood to South. The eight-hitter to lead it off. Bites that one off the fist. Is it going to hang up? Yes, it will. What a ridiculous play from Ryan Mountcastle. Sprawling out through foul territory, completely airborne, and wearing the impact as he lands on the heart for Anthony Santander. A couple of fly outs, and now a deep fly out to right field and gone. Have a series, Anthony Santander. He gets the birds right back into the ball game. Wheels down to their final out. And we're going to get a pinch hitter for McCann. This is Cedric Mullins. The pitch. Got him swinging. Yates punches out Mullins and adds an exclamation point to a 3-2 Rangers win over Baltimore.